we got everything? I think so. The general permit for the discharge of stormwater from small municipal separate storm sewer systems, otherwise known as MS4, is a Connecticut Department of Energy and Environmental Protection regulated permit intended to prevent stormwater pollution and protect our water bodies. However, this video will demonstrate sampling procedures that could be utilized in other states. Stormwater systems often discharge via outlets or outfalls to water bodies, thus, Keeping your stormwater free of pollutants helps to keep lakes, rivers, oceans, and other water bodies clean. An important aspect of this permit is to locate and eliminate illicit discharges from the stormwater system. Each MS4 is required to have an illicit discharge detection and elimination program, also referred to as IDDE, in which outfalls in their catchments are investigated. The best way to look for illicit discharges is during dry weather, as there should be no flow discharging then. Let's see how this is done. The first step of the investigation is to know where you are going. To do so, obtain the proper MS4 mapping so outfalls can be located in the field. Second, you must confirm that it has been dry weather for the past 24 hours and will continue to be dry when in the field. Now that the outfall has been located, use a phone, tablet, or a notebook to record screening items such as outfall coordinates, condition of the outfall or pipe, odor, or other evidence of an illicit discharge. If the outfall is dry, you are done. But if there is flow, a sample must be collected. In addition, if the outfall is submerged, field staff must proceed to the nearest upstream stormwater structure for screening and sampling in that location. And screened and analyzed for many parameters, either in the field with field kits or by a laboratory. The second part of the IDD program is the catchment investigation. All key junction manholes or structures must be screened and potentially sampled during dry weather. Here we are during dry weather looking at a key junction structure, in this case happens to be a catch basin, where two or more networks meet into one structure. After proper safety is ensured, open the key junction structure and screen the incoming pipes with the same methods as the outfall screening. By checking this junction, we may be able to pinpoint which direction potential dry weather flow and associated pollutants are coming from and potentially identify, isolate, and or confirm an illicit discharge. If there is dry weather flow, use a sampling device to collect a sample. Be sure to check your permit for the appropriate key junction sampling parameters. Once screening and potential sample collection is complete, reset the structure cover as it was. Continue this process for other outfalls and upstream key junctions to help find illicit discharges to the MS4. If illicit discharges are found, inform your MS4 IDDE program coordinator so that measures can be taken to eliminate it within permit timeframes. And always remember to, to protect, protect the, the waters, waters downstream, downstream, keep your stormwater clean. Hi everyone, thank you for watching our video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell. And don't forget to go into the links in the description and connect with HRP so we can help you move your environment forward. See you in the next video.